Hey everybody and welcome back to TGIFS and this is your guide to becoming a successful UNISA student. Now why did I want to start this guide? Personally I'm a UNISA student, I'm studying law, okay, and when I first started UNISA in 2017 in semester 2, I didn't really have an idea of what the heck was going on. I even watched UNISA's uh, videos that they do have online and I felt like there was stuff missing. Anyway, I do not own UNISA. UNISA has its own content and, and copyrights and everything, okay? I am just a student of UNISA. This guide is giving my experience, my expertise of me studying through UNISA and passing on my knowledge to students who might need it, okay? So, if you are looking at to become a UNISA student, you need to understand how UNISA differs from other universities. And that we'll be discussing in today's episode. Episode 1. What makes UNISA different from all the other universities? Okay. Now UNISA is not like the other universities. Okay. With other universities, you go to the campus, you go to your classroom, the elected lectures, give what, 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 you take notes in class and whatnot. With UNISA, that's different. You don't go to lectures. All your studying happens wherever you are, at home, at work. It's all on you. You have control of your studies. Okay? And in order to become in order to be in control of your studies, otherwise known as open distance learning, where you don't go to the campuses and whatnot, you gotta have, be a certain type of person. You've got to be disciplined in order to keep up with your studies and do well. You gotta be motivated. So you have external and internal motivators. Internal obviously comes from it within you, but external is like your family, your friends. They also gotta be motivating you too. Okay? So if you wanna study at UNISA, it's a big decision to make because it's not like all the other universities. It's a lot different, especially in the way that they take applications to registration, to getting your material, it's all different, okay? If you want to find out more about Open Distance Learning, you can go on to www.my, um, sorry, www.unisa.ac.za and there you'll see they have a readiness tool. If you go there and you do the readiness tool, I did it, even though I'm a registered student, I just thought, just to try it, see what it's like, okay? I suggest that you try that. It is very informative. It is a good thing that UNISA is doing. Thumbs up, UNISA. Okay. So I would check that out and see. And they'll give you a detailed response of how you did on that test. Okay. So this is it for today's episode. Please like and please subscribe to my YouTube channel, TGIFS. Okay. Or otherwise known as TS Guides and Incredible Fun Stuff channel. Okay. Also, while you're there, hit that little bell uh, icon so you'll get notifications on when the next video is ready to watch. Okay? This is TGIFS with your, your guide to, to become a successful UNISA student. Ciao for now.